guys welcome back to the channel and this lab is just recently updated and because of that the lab instruction are not properly configured so i request you please follow the way i am doing this lab so first of all just log in with your username one okay now just simply search for the vm instance click over here wait for a second and then click on this ssh it will take a couple of seconds meanwhile just simply come on the task number one okay scroll down and copy this command just wait Now let me increase the text size for you. Okay. Now here please pay attention. Run the first command. It will ask do you want to continue. So just press Y. And hit enter. And we are done with this command. Now just simply scroll down. Okay. Click on this check my progress. We will get a score without any issue. Okay. Now just simply come on the point number 6. Copy command from here till here. And make sure there is one extra space like this let me just zoom in for you like this just copy command like this come back over here and paste and here you can see there is one extra space now what you have to do just copy this zone carefully paste over here and here you can see this last alphabet you have to just change this alphabet to for you if it's a b c d so just change this accordingly for me it's c so i'm just going to change to a like this for you if it's a so you have to just change to b or c anything like this and hit enter so basically what we have to do we have to just update the zone once you're done with this command if you just simply scroll down and click on this check my progress you will get a score without any issue okay just wait and let's see okay now for the task number two what we have to do just copy this command run over here wait for a second now here just simply press 2 and hit enter now it's asking enter your username so just simply type user user and 2 and hit enter okay just wait and again press 2 and hit enter now it's asking do you want to continue just press y and hit enter now just copy this thing open the new tab paste over here click on the student scroll down click on apply or allow copy this token come back over here paste over here and hit enter now here please pay attention you have to choose your first project id and from here you can just cross verify so just check the last four digit so for me it's a 55 d so where it is for me it's on the second position for you it might be on first second third anything okay so just check make sure you have to choose the first project id so i'm going to press 2 and hit enter just wait for a couple of seconds and it's done and if you just simply scroll down and click on this check my progress you will get a score without any issue just wait and see okay now the main issue starting from here now what you have to do just simply come back over here and here please pay attention over here search for the IAM open this thing in new tab come back over here just wait and now what you have to do, you have to just check for this thing, compute at the rate developer dot g service account, this thing, you have to just check for this principle, just copy all this thing carefully, click on this manage resource, I request you please watch the video carefully. Now here you have to click on your second project ID, if you just simply come over here and from here you can just check, so just, so just check the last four digits, so for me it's F918, so this is F948, so just simply click over here. Click on your second project ID. Here you can see in permission tab, click on this add principle, paste the thing which you just copy from last task. Click on this blank space, it must look like this. Then click over here, click on this basic and then you have to choose the owner role and click on save. Just wait and it's done. Now in description box, I will share one link and then you are able to access this document. Now what you have to do, just copy this username, come back over here. And username section just paste now for the second user project id copy this project id second project id come back over here and paste like this now copy all the command at a time all this command go back to your ssh and run the command over here and hit enter now you don't have to do anything just sit and relax
and as you can see all the command execute without any issue now if you just simply come back to your lab instruction and click on the check my progress for all other tasks like this just wait for a couple of second because lab take couple of time to update the score just click on all the check my progress okay so where i didn't get on this task and here also and as you can see i got a score for each and every task let me just click on here and here you can see 100 out of 100 and that's the way we have to complete this lab i hope you guys like the way i solve this lab if you do just give one thumbs up and comment down below is this helpful for you or not so that youtube algorithm promote this video and other can complete their lab without any issue thanks for watching and have a good day guys